You're listening to the American Democracy Minute, keeping your government buy-in for the people. We're headed back to Ohio today, where on July 19th, the Ohio Supreme Court rejected another set of GOP-drawn congressional district maps because they were gerrymandered for partisan gain. You'll remember that Ohio's legislature had thrown up its hands and resubmitted a map previously rejected by the Ohio Supreme Court. The state was under pressure to get the maps in place for the Ohio primary on August 2nd, but now whatever maps are agreed upon will not be in force until 2024. The Associated Press reports that the rejected map created 10 safe Republican seats and 5 Democratic seats. However, the high court's majority said the latest map packed surrounding Democrats into three of the Democratic-leaning congressional districts, which diluted the Democratic voting power and strengthened Republican power around heavily Democratic Cleveland, Cincinnati, and Columbus. The 4-3 decision by the Ohio Supreme Court cited the 2018 state constitutional amendment prohibiting partisan gerrymandering. GOP legislative leaders had said the rejected map was the best they could do, but the court included a fair map model in their opinion, giving a representative share of seats to both parties. The court gives the legislature 30 days from July 19th to come back with a fair map. If the legislature fails, it returns to Ohio's redistricting commission. Read the AP story and get connected with groups taking action at AmericanDemocracyMinute.org. For the American Democracy Minute, I'm Brian Beal.